So I'm having fun and games here, being a power cut, they've got electric gates, I can't get out and they can't find the key, so I'm stuck, I can't get out. <laughs> morning it is lovely nice wet one today uh -huh. Get, getting the wet gear sorted out so it's chance so can't believe it can you it's absolutely teeming it out has been all night in fact it's kept me up half at night to be honest with you starting a new job today it's about 170 meters a two meter iv mesh at a site down in bingley uh we already loaded up we got it done friday so we'll shoot on down there and then we'll uh, see how we get on so we're just at this job here, I'm just showing guys are walking off in distance up there. I'm just showing them where this fence is going. But basically I don't know if you can see, it's going all the way down inside of this. These bushes, these are nice prickly bushes, so I don't think anyone's getting through there. I'll just turn it around. We've got to block both sides of these fire exits off along there, but it's going all the way along there. And all the way down there, we'll just have to sneak out back of these big trees. It won't be a bad job this. On a night, as you can imagine, it's pretty quiet down here. We're getting uh, drug dealers or whatever, even dogs walking. So yeah, should be a good little job for guys, this one. We're probably going to start. Come on yo, stop fagging. This is gonna start there where where Baggy's marking his first post. Just up bridge there. I'm just waiting on a delivery coming. Just about to get my fork truck out. It's already warm looks lads have been unloaded up for what they need today. Um, should be here any minute. And then I've just got a job to see the top of Keyfly somewhere auctioning up for the church I think it is and then uh, I'm gonna go pop in and see the lads on the way back I'll catch up with yourself Hi there so we're just at this job at Bingley for James Moore Flex guys are being really cracking on see them there I don't know if you can see that they've gone all the way around here but yeah it's uh, looking good a bit, bit wet and muddy yesterday so I've got my <laughs> mud and cement all over but they'll uh, They'll clean that up with jet wash when they when they're done. I've literally had loads of people try to get through as they've been installing it. Just stops all the dogs coming on here and crapping all over. And they've actually put this piece on here which is pretty good just to stop people obviously climbing up wall here and getting straight around. That's looking good. Wednesday morning I'm just at the yard, the delivery's about to turn up that were pretty much unannounced so I've had to quickly scramble and reschedule my appointments but I'm not even sure where this wagon coming for me is going to park to get, so I can unload it with fork truck it's, it's literally chocker everywhere normally on a Tuesday it's pretty clear around here but look, it's absolutely chocker everywhere they just turned up, thank god he's on a small truck. Looking good days, we've been waiting for these. Nice crank force. This powder coating's a bit rough in here. Really, really rough. Compared to on there. So I hope we recognise this one that we did in the summer. St Matthew's School. Click here to watch that one, St Matthews. Um, clients just want us back, they want some more. So I'm going to have to turn this off now because uh, the kids are actually out. So. so 
So yes, yeah, just finished uh, my site survey at uh, St Matthew's School again. We're wanting quite a bit more doing now. I don't know if you can see in the distance down there where that timber fence is. I'll turn it round where this timber fence is down down there. All that's to come out, and then basically they want some from that mesh we did in woods all the way up there to some other mesh that we've done. So should have that. So I'm having fun and games here. I've uh, been to see a job at like a big country estate in Weatherby. Come to drive out, and there's been a power cut. They've got electric gates. I can't get out, and they can't find the key for the manual override. So I'm stuck. I can't get out. <laughs> what an absolute nightmare! Silly iron gates here, look on the entrance. I mean, it's a lovely place where it is. It's, you've got a massive house up here. I literally can't get out. I've been here for over half an hour waiting to get out. Right, so it's Friday morning, cold morning. It's a nice dry one. Looks like it'll be a nice day once the sun gets out. See, I've got my lovely hat on. Just loading up uh, the job over in Leeds is on it. I think it's about 25 metres, 2 metre high mesh and some big 7 metre double gates. Just loading up. I'm going to take two vans this morning. I'm going to take this one with fencing on. Um, and lads are going to go in this one with, with digger on because we've got to dig the gate for some, some solid concrete. So probably going to need pecker. Yeah, we're just down at this uh, total resources job we're about to start. We're just unloading. You can see we're unloading everything here. Fencing there. Bag is just unloaded, digger and stuff here. We've got to dig through this, I'll turn it around. We've got to dig through this hard concrete here, so we, we brought digger with pecker on. Just makes it a lot easier rather than two hours with handbreaker. Basically seven metre double leaf gates in here just to stop everyone getting in and nicking fuel out of vans and stuff on the night there's about I think there's 25 metres of fencing 24 just going up up the line down there it's a nice easy job day job we'll get these gate posts in and then just nip back in the morning and stick the gates on and that's it we're all ready need some tackle though to put up a fence these days this lot here <laughs> a little fence Amazing, mate. 